to the night of CW in Allen and you guys can join me. I'm going to talk to some of the artists and they're local, they're great, they're right here in Chicago. We're going to learn about what they're doing in Poland. They're leaving next month and I get to have a <laughs> really, <laughs> really see the hub, really? <laughs> I don't know what to say about this trip. I'm just going. Man, I'm sliding out this chair. <laughs> All I know is I trust C-Dub and I'm going with him to a different country and that's it. <laughs> so C-W, uh, the artist, um, he asked me to DJ. So I DJ and uh, so I DJ and I'm his friend. C-Dub has friends. He actually has a lot of friends. Um, we don't really talk about them. But, and I started doing um, backup vocals and violin for his sets. Through that experience, I think Sita became like a brother to me and a musical mentor. I want to create urban artists. I want to do shows in urban contexts for college students and different people, so. Through music, you're able to tell a story about somebody's life. <laughs> it's therapy. For me, music is therapy. Um, excuse me? Excuse me? You only live once, don't let the years go. And God give it to you, make sure that you let them know that we young. You're able to experience what somebody is going through when you listen to a song. Someone can write a breakup song and everybody could be like, dang, I remember my stomach twisting up. Like you can visually see it in your head and your heart if you went through that. So everybody in the building is connecting at that concert like, yeah, me too, you know. <laughs> Conversation, nervous, but he stepped up. Couple jokes, she start to blush. Couple dense emotions shook and a couple changes on Facebook. Hey lady, how you doing? She said, I'm doing fine. He said, I know you are, but can I have some time? Maybe even your number. When the minutes bring, I'll call you. We can chat, dream big about building a future. I know your past ain't perfect. I love how music can impact people, change people's lives. Music is transcendent. Would you say that music is like a form of art? <laughs> Absolutely not. It's just universal. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> music is like color to the world. It's like a soundtrack to your life. So I learned how to sing from my mom. I've been living in Chicago eight years. Yeah, I think when I initially started at 19, it was like, I just was freestyling out of somebody daring me and for fun. How long have you had like a career in music? How long have you been here? Uh, since 2000. And then people were like, yo, you actually sound good at this, like. This is what God had given me. Like he'd given me this gift and this responsibility and I wanted to use it to love people. Music is definitely one of those things that brings cultures together, um, especially if you think about even like music with a faith tradition or music that talks about love because um, everybody can identify with love and everybody can identify with having faith. I think that as a Christian, like it's going to impact so many areas of your life. Obviously it's going to imp impact your music and also um, how you love people through music. So I, I just joined staff with a, a nonprofit called uh, ACT International, a Christian sending board for artists. And they support you, encourage you. He told me about this opportunity that he had to tour across Poland. <laughs> I think 
touring is easy, but doing three shows in a day is pretty tough. I've done that before, so. It's kind of like a foreign exchange of music, and they uh, travel the country. So we hit eight different cities, and uh, we're doing like three shows a day for two weeks. So it's gonna be pretty intense. There's a royal ball, all of that. We were invited by the, um, the Count of Poland, so Count Richard. <laughs> so we're the hip hop artist component this year. The biggest thing is we just need support, not just you know people liking it on Facebook or retweeting it, but we need like financial support. Um, they can go to my website, uh, thecwallen.com. Long term, this is gonna benefit other artists who, yeah, I started when I was 19, I'm 30 now. It took years to finally get to this place, but I think I can cut that in half for some artists catch them in their prime and, and help them to just go for it. Cool, that's perfect. Okay. Hey you guys, thanks so much for watching The Full Color Life. Please hit subscribe, like this video, and check out their website.